Hello, and welcome to your weekly Idaho coronavirus update. I'm Ruth Brown. The Department of Health and Welfare is asking Idahoans to answer an anonymous survey about how the pandemic has impacted their life and mental health. The survey is open through October 31st and can be found online at coronavirus.idaho.gov backslash behavioral health. Some hospitals in Idaho continue to use crisis standards of care as unvaccinated COVID-19 patients continue to flood hospital beds. Statewide on Thursday, there were only 15 open ICU beds for new patients. There have been no pediatric deaths due to COVID-19 as of Thursday, but there have been pediatric hospitalizations and serious child illnesses due to the virus. Case positivity rates have dropped modestly, down to 13.2%, but that's still well above the goal of keeping the rate below 5%. State hospital officials continue to stress that the best way to prevent hospitalization due to COVID is to be vaccinated. Vaccinated people are four times less likely than unvaccinated people to contract the virus, and if they do, they are five times less likely to need hospitalization, according to Central District Health on Thursday. Visit the Idaho Reports blog at idahoptv.org backslash Idaho Reports to see the latest updates on COVID-19. We'll see you here next week, and until then, stay safe, Idaho.